Hello everyone. Today our topic is to enlighten you about pro- power of collective prayer. The Holy Bible teaches that when two or more people on earth agree about something they pray for, it can be a very powerful and meaningful experience. Whether it is a shared hope, a common goal, or a heartfelt request, the act of agreement in prayer can create a sense of unity and connection. Let us see what Bible say about it in Matthew chapter 18 verses 19. Again I say unto you that if two of you shall agree on earth concerning anything that they shall ask it shall be done for them by my father who is in heaven. Verses B states that For where two or three are gathered together in my name I am there in the midst of them. In Deuteronomy chapter 32 30 we find that one can chase a thousand people but two can put 10000 people what a wonderful message that two can chase not 2000 but 10000 now you can understand the value of collective prayers if your church has prayer gatherings or corporate prayer meetings you should participate remember if there is anything that a church should be about It should be prayer a praying church can only enjoy the fruit of God's favor. The church cannot hope to achieve any meaningful successes without it. Jesus wasn't kidding when he said, "Without me you can do nothing." John 15:5. People rarely understand the great need to pray for their church, its leaders who deal with enormous spiritual challenges. Besides just doing their best to survive the modern trends of declining attendance so they can minister to people who generally have overwhelming problems pastors also frequently struggle with their own personal difficulties church members may not realize that pastors often suffer some of the highest occurrences of stress related illnesses and since they often find the challenges of ministry so great It's been reported that hundreds of pastors quit the ministry each month. Quoting from Isaiah 56, 7, Jesus said, "It is written, My house shall be called a house of prayer." Matthew 21:13. When in need of prayer, such meetings are a good place to come and request the combined prayers from your fellow believers. It's also a tremendous opportunity for you to join with combined prayer for others as well as for the pastor and the church. Basically, all believers need prayer and we all are charged with the responsibility of praying for each other. The Holy Bible says in Ephesians 6:18 that stay alert and be persistent in your prayers for all believers everywhere. Time and again I have witnessed the amazing results of believers praying together in agreement for various needs including when we pray for the sick people. The importance of this principle have been conveyed to the many congregations I have ministered to. In my view, promises of Jesus to bring his presence to wherever two or more are gathered in his name and to answer their prayers of faith and agreement is one of the most astounding promises in the Bible. This something that Christians need to appreciate and implement every time they meet. An example of this can be seen in scripture. When the church body prayed together for Peter, who had been arrested and jailed by King Herod. We read in Acts while Peter was in prison, the church prayed very earnestly for him. And as they prayed, an angel appeared to Peter and miraculously led him out of the prison. But when he soon came knocking at their door most could not believe it was him Though a servant girl recognized it was Peter many scoffed and even assumed it had to be his diseased spirit until they finally opened the door and realized it was really him Remember that prayer is deeply personal and its effects may not always be immediately visible Whether it is a simple wish for peace or a heartfelt plea for healing, the act of agreement in prayer can create a ripple of positive energy in our life. In our coming videos, we will be dealing with prayer in great detail. 
Kindly subscribe to our videos and like it so that we may come with videos of high quality materials which will benefit everyone. We pray that God bless you all with good health and mental peace and happiness in the coming days. Thank you.